90s edition. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Welcome, everybody, back to uh, Brother Sister Season 2. Season 2, it's time to play. Oh, man. You guys, you don't know how excited I am. This is my favorite among the Monkey Island series. And why is that, right. little sister? Um, I think it just there's just it's more there was more puzzles there was more things to figure out there were more locations to travel to uh basically everything that i loved about the first game is in this game just extra ah and like good millennials or or what's the post millennial now we know that when something is extra that means it's dramatic it's better so this Monkey Island 2 is so extra. You hear that, Zennials? Extra. Anyway, let's get into the game. Let's give it a start. So we're going to start play play, playing a new game. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is the new hey. version. I'm going to Well, well, well. Guy Brush oh, no, what Streetwood. The? You do turn it's up not letting me switch. dangerous places. It's not letting me switch. Uh, hi, Elaine. Uh, oh, you man. think you can help me out? So, sorry, How everybody. Get into this we gotta mess. suffer the cool, it's kind of a long story. new oh, graphics. That's okay. Before getting into I've got time. Uh, well, oh, the voice oh, it all so started good, on Scab Island. But Some Elaine, of my admiring I, fans like have pressured me into telling my LeChuck evaporating story once again. Okay, let's see. Well, let Deep me in now. the Caribbean. No, still not. Scab no, go to settings. There has to be a way to just turn it off. I thought it was uh, so. The other one was F10. I could just switch back and forth. Uh, oh, maybe I have to go. Maybe I have to do it here. I thought there was a quick setting. Maybe not. Okay. So oh. now uh, back and resume game. So I bust what into the? the church and say, "Now what? you're in for it, you uh. filious bag of barnacle bait!" Oh, okay. And then the Chuck cries. Uh, my name's Ron Gilmer. This is whoa! Look at that everyone. commentary. <laughs> But well, we don't want. We have the commentary. That's right. Oh man, you're right. Yeah. But if I hear oh man, this story that's pretty cool. I did not realize I'm gonna they be were there. Myself. Don't you have any new stories? Well, actually, that's why I'm here on Scab Island. I'm on a whole new adventure. Growing a mustache. No, bigger than growing a mustache. Funny joke. No, I'm in search of the biggest treasure of them all. They do have some goofy looking faces. So valuable and so well hidden that it haunts the dreams of every pirate on the seas. What is this treasure, Guybrush? Big whoop. Big whoop. None other. Then Big why'd you come whoop. here? There's no treasure on Scab Island. I refuse well, I didn't know to believe that before. That now there I'm trying to charter to a ship and look someplace off. else. Well, there probably when is, I return, but I'll I, have riches well, galore and a whole new story. Or you'll uh, have died trying. Either talking. way, we won't have to hear yeah, about that me. chuck anymore. Oh, no. Press escape. Ah. Escape. Okay. So, now, let's let him settle down. And then once we have control, those guys wouldn't again. know a good story even if they paid fifty bucks for it. Oh, look at that! You I can barely see his little like clean. A legend among his face still looks like relatively clean shaven. Can only in this. charter a ship so and get off this stinking island. He looks like he kind of has a beard, a bit more of a beard. Okay. All right, before you move. The Largo Inn. Oh man! No matter where you go on sea or land, you can never escape from Largo Legrand. Largo Legrand. Oh, here we go. Now let's switch back. Oh, wait, what the? Ah! All right, stop. Stop. Okay. There's got to be a way before you do anything nope. else. Options. Settings. Classic mode, voice dialogue. Oh, no, we don't want the voice dialogue. Okay, never mind. Back. Back. Wait, but that's back. just dialogue, though. Classic edition credits. Wait, how to play? Maybe no. controls. a different it's button controls. this time. Trigger commentary. Switch mode F1. Why would they have a completely different button for switching back? Uh, who? Yeah, who is it? Who is responsible for making these remakes? I don't there know. There we go. All right, all right. Oh. Before you do anything, I have a little fun fact. What's that? Let's hear the fun fact. Pick up the shovel off the sign. Oh, right here. Uh, it doesn't let me. Yes, you just click pick up. Pick Welcome up. Welcome to Woodtick. Oh, okay. I'm going to pick up. Pick up sign. What the? Okay. Okay, so I got a shovel. So, so many people, when they first played this game, that was like the first thing they did, and they talk about how people thought that they had done something wrong and would keep starting a new game over and over again because they didn't think they were supposed to break the sign. 
Oh, because it's got this cancel symbol here. Yeah, and then it says, like, oh, no, I think I broke it. But, man, okay, look at us. Look at our inventory. We got uh, riches. We got, mm, look at all the gold. Mm, mm, mm. Guybrush got that sweet, sweet cheddar. But what's that stack of things? Wait, here? Is that paper? No, the paper. Or those are deeds. Yo-ho. Yo-ho deeds. Oh, because the pirates. Maybe? Let's see. <laughs> Let's read it. This is maybe a lot of money, but it's nothing compared to how... Oh. Look at riches. Oh, they're all one riches. I wish they were individual oh. riches. Well, you know what? They probably are deeds for something. Maybe pirate ships? I don't know. I just want to point out... Oh, like, yes. El Polio de Mavlo, you can play this with the new voices on the classic game. So, I mean, okay. What did... I mean, pirate... Or Guybrush would have been really successful to, like, get all this. And yeah. And I just don't think he's that good a pirate. This is a little... Un oh, Whoa. oh, man. Where do you fancy think you go, France, France? Oh, Whoa. Largo. Are they talking faster? Who's going to make Did you speed, did you speed up their dialogue? I don't think so. I didn't mean to if I did. Uh, do we uh, want cowardly bribe. guy brush? No, it's a bribe situation. We got money. Oh, we can give we them a bribe. We do have quite a bit of money. Oh, what the? Largo. Oh, Largo. <laughs> oh, no. Please. Oh, no. Uh, yeah. Then who keeps the law and maintains order? Oh. Poppy. He's oh, Batman. No. Look at this little face. This little eyeball. He's... Largo is Batman. Largo is Batman of Scab Island. Listen, he's even cooler than Batman because he has a rhyme that he can say whenever he leaves a situation. Wait, what happened to all of my money? He took it all. All of it, but it didn't. Even, I didn't even see it fall out or anything. I'm pretty sure uh, Tim Schafer and Rom Gilbert talked about how that was like their first prank on the player of the game. Was uh... that like in the first game we worked so hard to get money, and then in this game we start off with so much money and then immediately just lose it all. Oh, that's we have a torture. Shovel. That's torture. I want. Oh, oh man, I gotta just take all my right, stuff from me. All right, so. We're in a really gross place called Scab Island. Who wants to be on an island called Scab Island? It's kind of yeah. gross. And what are we doing here? What like what's the point? So we, we kind of we're talking a bit over that little we're, intro. We're hunting for Big Whoop. Big Whoop. Okay, I'm curious. Did we know like okay, I mean in all the promotional materials, do they like give hints about Big Whoop? Is that how they like tried to sell this game version I of the game? I have no idea. I think people just loved the first one so much that they would buy this one regardless. Okay. All right, um, you're in the just the worst place because we can't do anything in here yet. Probably that Largo guy, but maybe this guy hates Largo too. Oh, look at that! He wants to make an end. Oh, Largo. see, well, no one has the guts to do anything though. Guybrush has guts. Oh, so this is where it starts off with the very first person you talk to is <laughs> you got to get that voodoo doll. Woodchuck could chuck no amount. Oh no, that was way too fast. Yeah, you you're sped right. it up. But if it's a woodchuck could chuck and would chuck some amount of wood, what amount of wood would a woodchuck chuck? So I how long do you think it took programmers to yeah. just put in all of this dialogue? As long as a woodchuck should chuck wood, if a woodchuck could chuck wood, as long as a woodchuck would chuck wood. No, that's not good logic, Guybrush. If therefore, nope. Aha! We beat him. He I got annoyed that. with us first. No, I'm a woodsmith. Oh. Wait, do woodsmiths wear aprons with blood on them? I guess this one does. Oh, oh. but you know what? He's making, like, peg legs and stuff, I so. I guess he gets splinters. He gets splinters. He's probably the town doctor and woodsmith. That's like, he'll right. chop and off your dentist. leg and, and then fit you with, I guess with the, the wooden one. If you're good back then, if you're good with tools, you had all the jobs. That's, that matters. Okay, where do I go, little sister? Oh, better than Pest Island. Uh, Ooh, go, splinters in your tummy. Uh, go down those steps. These ones? We're gonna go to the bar. That's Hatch. a per perfect place to go. Ah, just like in the first game. You need a good bar <laughs> to start you off. Oh, that's true. Yep. Oh, this uh, guy's pretty gross. always gross. Yeah, he, the, he spits into the glass to clean it. Who started that trope? That's that actually, gross. that is a trope. Like, that's a, that's a, like, usually in westerns they do that. Yeah. Like, okay. um, the gritty bar man do i talk to him yeah we gotta yeah boy get some info Ooh, 
<laughs> want to see my scar. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, that's like, that's a horrible opening line, Guybrush. Like, Guybrush is a bit socially awkward, I think. Oh, Sneaky Kiki, he probably does have a bacterial infection. Gross. Or maybe, because he's a pirate, his mouth is so full of bacteria that it's kind of like a dog's, and that it actually, oh. like, sanitizes things, right? Because, like, dogs no. oh, can sanitize things. Oh, no, things. Here he comes oh, no again. he's back! Oh, but he's a broly. Oh, yeah. Look, he's gonna... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Loogie. That's some sweet animations. Oh, wait a minute. I think I remember what I do with that spit. Yeah. Oh, why is this game so gross? Because it's amazing. I think oh. a lot of other gross things happen in this in this sequel. Do I talk to All the right. barkeep again, or do I... Uh, oh. go upstairs. Hold on, go I want to just look at it. Marco's been here. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> a... <laughs> oh, I'm. Oh no. That's the sign That's... of Largo. Is when he he just spits it. Actually, I wonder. Are there any other places in the game where we see like a little spit? Uh, yes. All right. Now we're gonna go left. We're gonna go to the hotel. Wait, I one? always loved this atmosphere. Like all the ships together make a town. It's very clever. Yeah, a little pirate like shanty cove. Let's just. Oh, we're gonna... oh no! Wait. Oh. I'm sorry. Go back out. Oh, a little pet alligator. That's cute. No, he's his name's like Leg Biter. He makes people get peg legs. Oh. Uh, so you see the window where the bar? Okay, so there's the bar. There. Move your oh, mouth here. Um, to the left. Yeah. A window. That window. Yes. We're gonna we're gonna go in there. Oh my goodness! I never would have like thought about that. Like you seriously would have had to scroll around everything. The whole thing. It took a long time for me to figure out window. that you can get in there. Ah, oh, nice. Hops, Skybrush. Oh, look at this little hot dog dude. Or is that corn on the cob? Or no, he's wearing gloves. He's doing dishes. No, he's peeling potatoes. Oh. Look at him. Oh, oh yeah. Alright, we're, we're gonna pick up that knife on the table. We're just gonna steal the knife from behind him. Uh, pick up knife. How did I see this as a child? Is there anything else? I had to go canned a goods? lot slower. Can I pick up canned goods? No, you can't. Ah, fruit no, cocktail. Yeah, fruit cocktail. canned fruit. Well, Coffee. canned fruit cocktail is pretty gross. What's that the worst? Just... What's the worst canned food you can get? I mean, that's human food. Oh, uh, spinach. Canned spinach. Uh, Nothing sounds yummy. Man, yeah, no, but like you could mix that into a soup and it'd be okay. What about spam? Canned spam. Yeah, but canned spam is basically. Thank you, DPO. I said food. spinach. Okay, we got two votes for spinach. Hey, I'm winning right now. I saw canned peanuts once. I think that's pretty gross. Canned peanuts? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's like, trying to work. You got to leave through the window or we can get in trouble by oh. a barkeep. Oh, well, out the way we came, I guess. Better out Bloop. than in. Oh! Ooh, shady eyes. Oh, he, just, he doesn't want people to know that he uh he tripped a little bit. That's okay, guy. All right, go back to the hotel. Okay. Am I going to stab the little baby alligator? Has oh, this been one big, <laughs> long ploy for you to murder a baby alligator? Uh, no animals will be harmed. Oh, wait, that's not true. We're just oh. going to keep playing. Oh, my goodness. Okay, use the knife on, on the rope. On baby alligator. Oh, it won't no, even let me. Oh, oh no, rope. it will. On the rope. What happens if I yeah. do use it? My scoutmaster would kill me. Aww. Oh, he had a scoutmaster? Good job, Guybrush. <laughs> Stick to your morals. Okay, so yes, now as free. many worlds as you can have as a pirate. Peg biter. Oh, look at his <laughs> little peg leg. Before he catches someone else. Oh, man. And this, children, is why you shouldn't have a pet alligator. Oh, wait. Okay, now you got to look in his bowl. There's a bowl? Yeah, the, bowl? the little peg biter's bowl. Oh, okay. Look but you have to specifically look bowl. in it. Cheese squigglies. Cheese squigglies. Oh, Got him. Yeah. Little Cheetos. Oh, Cheetos. All right. Want to go, like, mess around in Largo's room? Wait, right Largo stays at the hotel? I does. Oh. For free, I'm sure. Well, for extortion costs. Open door. Go inside. Ooh, what a room. Leftover. Ooh, steal his toupee. Largo, ah, where's your toupee? Except you're bald. That's a joke. I know, but I'm I'm going bald. Oh no! You know what? That 
that toupee is not even the same color as the Whoa, Harry's he just said now. a cuss. He just said a cuss. Oh, man. Oh. Little kid version of me would have went crazy. Wait, no, how do I get into his room? Uh, we're just going to leave for now. Is that all I needed to take was his toupee? For now. We'll go bother him again. Oh, I don't like bald shaming people. Is that what we're going to do to Largo? Yep. Oh, man. Okay, now what? Where do I go? Uh, we need rope. So we're going to leave this section of town. Okay. Every good game, like we mentioned before, you need a good bit of rope. That is the the, the priceless adventuring Oh, item. we did need that in the last game, too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We're going to go visit the voodoo lady again. Ah, uh, recurring so character. We'll go to the swamp. The swamp. The swamp. Ah, there's swamp. Oh, wait, did you pick up the stick when we left the beach? Oh, was I supposed to pick up a stick? Yeah, there's a stick there. I'm pretty sure we need the stick to paddle. I don't know if we use the shovel to paddle. I think we use the oh, stick. Oh, but Sneaky Kiki, I don't want to shame anybody. Why can't we just have nice games where people are nice to one another? Whoa, look, at there is a little stick there. That seems like poor game planning. Like, come on, at least let me, like, wiggle oh. a tree. Listen. Yeah? This game, there's a lot of running around. Like, there, are, uh, just, there's got to be, like, quadruple the locations in this game compared to the first one. And the puzzles are a little bit more tricky because, like, you wouldn't know there was cheese squiggles in the bowl. Like, you ha had to look actually look everything. in the bowl. Yeah. yeah. Uh, All right, you use coffin. Coffin. So, I know there's probably oh. a story behind this. Like, why is there, like, a wing? on that sign and a coffin as a rowboat well you know how what we can how we can find out and we just look at it nope oh what the oh maybe it's probably gonna... wrote ashore first yeah see what he says when he oh looks at the coffin. no i was trying to have it the commentary pop it up but apparently there's no commentary for this so look at coffin whose coffin is it does it have a name on it creepy but oh creepy similar. okay and what does the sign look say look at the sign this is mojo international house of mojo well, maybe the wing is the international sign of Mojo's oh. symbol. It must be. See, I never questioned these things as a child. It just made sense. Or like, maybe of course. this is pre-Red Bull, because Red Bull... Oh, <laughs> gives you wings? Yeah. All right. Ah, look at the little bats. Bro. This is kind of scary. It is. Uh -oh. But this looks like just like the Voodoo Lady's house in Pirates of the Caribbean. So. Oh, man. Another giant skull. We had a giant that. monkey skull. <laughs> now we got a, this giant. Mojo, Jojo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Dave. Oh, wait. Oh. Okay, so there's Powerpuff string. Girls reference for the win. There's string right next to that skull. Pick it up. What the? How would yeah. I ever see this you tiny? You had to look at everything. Oh, man. I didn't know adventure games right. were like Seek and Finds. Actually, that's not true. I did know that, but I didn't quite remember how Seek and Finds were. Way to the right. And we're going to talk to the voodoo lady. And we've had a couple people tell us now. We need that. You might have to slow this down. We're never going to be able to know what she says. Because the speaking's Do going way too fast. Ah, uh, we often forget those who help us most. I was the one who told you to do with the chuck. And about the voodoo anti-root. And how to turn powerful ghosts into... Going... Oh, she yeah. didn't tell us about the anti-root, though. Voodoo I remember. lady. Unless she... No, it was the cannibals. I know. But we never see their faces. Maybe she's been a cannibal all along. Uh, I'm pretty sure we saw their abs, so... Well, maybe <laughs> she was wearing a sports bra. Nope, they were bare-chested. Maybe it was a skin-colored sports bra. Okay, no. <laughs> oh, what are in those jars? Those are seahorses, or sea monkeys, as one might say. Oh, yeah, and they're dead. Well, or they're living. They're just, like, staring intently at this conversation they are kind of creepy see now i want to know what they drew there in the new version uh quick way to find out oh so they're just fuzzy and you can't tell Man. oh that's lame that's <sighs> way cooler in the old version I think collectively as a group let's write let's write some complaint letters right that's what that's what people do nowadays they complain yeah. and get people fired which i don't necessarily oh like this is great either. the ingredients that we need it rhymes as well Voodoo groups. Something of the thread, something of the head, something of the body, something of the dead. That almost rhymes. No, it does rhyme, Guybrush. Anything can be poetry. 
go to school. I guess they really liked rhyming in this game. I love that we get a shopping list to make a voodoo doll. I have his toupee. Not quite part of his head. Ooh, scalp fragments. She's about to do some forensics work here. Oh, whoa. She just peed all that. So you know what those fluids. fluids were going to get of his, right? Oh, I knew. <laughs> I knew it would come back to haunt us in some way. Oh. Yes, DP. I know. I keep yelling at Big Brother, but he won't slow the dialogue well, down. Okay. Well, so, but how? Okay. So I'll go to options, and then controls. No. Nope. No settings. Settings. Go Subtitles. to the arrow. The arrow. Title All right. Volume. It's full screen. See, I don't see it in here. There is a way to slow it down. I was gonna do it on non-game time. That's fine. We can get it. We'll figure it out for next week. Okay, use the coffin. We're just going to keep toting along, man. We already got one of the ingredients. So what are we trying to do? So now we're trying to make a voodoo a doll? So we haven't. We can go talk to him, but I'm kind of doing things. Oh, look at that. Thank you. Uh, who, who said the plus minus? Someone said that. Oh, ah, Sneaky Kiki. Ah, thank you. Sneaky Kiki for the tip. That is crazy. And that's like in the classic game. So that was built into the adventure. No wonder it's not in the settings. Woohoo. So but they couldn't make the art the slower. same sadness. Uh, great All success. All right. So go to the, go to the pen pe peninsula. Over here. By the way, yep. what tick is such a gross name for a town? It, uh, okay, ticks are the worst creatures ever. And they're super dangerous. Well, I guess the deer ticks are more dangerous than deer ticks i think but most still. ticks are just gross and dangerous they're almost as bad as leeches <laughs> did you ever realize that a leech is basically a worm and a tick combined that is horrifying okay. that is the most <laughs> horrifying description and that explains why <laughs> i it's okay sneak every, is secret oh to everybody here brother is deathly afraid of leeches and so is sister <laughs> we have the same fear oh man uh, it's Captain. I forget Captain your name. Captain Dread. Ooh. Mm, it's a little tropey. Look, he's all sad. He wants to leave the island, but he can't because Largo won't let him. Hello, man. Hello, man. Uh, okay. What can I do for you? Natty Dread. Yeah, they are. Is that a compliment? I guess it yeah. is probably a compliment. Need to charter a ship. Because. Oh, lucky sailing necklace. Of course, I want it. What I need a lucky sailing necklace. Aww. Okay. No ships. Oh man, this Largo guy. What a bully. A Largo, an embargo, man. All the rhymes. A Largo embargo. Um. Okay, so he needs a little little necklace to make him feel good about okay. sailing again, and we also gotta get rid of. Largo. I just want to point out like our biggest problem right now. Captain Dread is is kind of kind of a badass. Look at these all these shark teeth. Yeah, look at, he caught all them. And look at he's just you know forlornly looking out the front of the ship, oh, just wants a, to leave. What a dreamy look. That's a it's a dreamy, sad, forlorn. Actually, forlorn's the best word. That's the best adjective to use. He's forlorn. Mm -hmm. All right, now we're gonna go back to the ship. We're going to go back to Wood Tick. <laughs> I'm going to shudder every yeah. time we have to say that name. There's a cemetery down here, a swamp. But we can't go to yeah. the top of the mountain. This is no... Which seems a little silly since Legend it's there. of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Oh, man. Great game. Okay. All right. We're going to go all the way back where we haven't been yet. This one? To the laundromat. Wait, yeah. the pirates have a laundromat? Is that what all these hanging things are? Yeah, they're all just people's clothes, you know? You gotta gotta get your dry cleaning in. Oh, hey, it's those guys. That's the guys the, are sleeping. The men of low, low moral fiber. That, that's another Pick up that callback. bucket. This one? Yep. Okay, pick up You know what? They try to give us trouble this time. You know what? There was a rat around their feet in the first game, too. Oh, sorry. Is this your bucket? Ugh. What is <laughs> he gonna do with a bucket? 
Why? All right. Why okay. Do do Anyone that? who's ever a kid growing up and who liked the woods knows what we're going to do. Open that box. Oh, wait. I want to talk to this guy. No, we don't what want to talk to him. He, he's just going to complain about Kate, Largo, too. Little sister, you're forgetting that one of the best parts of this game is the beautiful, wonderful dialogue. Who are the you? Dialogue is amazing. Do you even know this guy's name? Oh, he can't even hear us. That's good. Mad Marty! Mad yeah. Marty. Oh, man. He's mad. He's mad about getting your clothes clean. Shoot. Um, oh, he has no problem hearing us then. Well, I mean, he's, his ears are tuned. Alterations? <laughs> and your food stamps? Alterations. Oh, that's right. Alterations. Read better, brother. Okay. Um. Well, I'm going to pick up some clothes. Oh, but I don't have a, claim a laundry ticket. claim ticket. No, I don't have my claim ticket. I lost it while being keel hauled. What is he gonna Ugh. respond? What the heck Your is he called? Your dog got mauled. Oh, <laughs> oh, Mad Marty, show some sympathy. Okay. Nah, so, oops, I thought care. I wanted to talk to you, but I don't. <laughs> <laughs> that is, I'm gonna oh. use that real life. Yeah. We're okay. Five, five sibling points to anyone that actually uses that in a real life conversation at some yes. point this next week. <laughs> oh, sorry. I thought I wanted to talk to you, but I don't. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> oh, okay. Open up that box. No, oh, there's no, a box. No. Oh, this box? Yeah, open it a box. But don't I need a tool to open it? No, and then we're going to use the stick to hold up the lid. Oh. And then we're going to use string on the stick. I know what we're doing. Yeah, and we're going to put the cheese squiggles in the box. Cheese squiggles in the box. All right, now we got to walk away so that we can trap the rat. And pull. Keep, keep, no, keep oh. walking away. Chase them to the other side. Okay. Keep going. There. Gotta get out. Oh, there he is. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Whoa. Now open the box and it won't, he won't escape. Pick up. Box. No, no, you gotta open the box. Oh. Oh, wait a minute, Guybrush. A box won't fit in your pocket, but mm. you have a shovel, a bucket, a knife, a rat, and a, we're gonna get a whole bunch of other stuff. Well, but a box. I mean, the bucket That's and the shovel are kind of taking up some room. That could be it. Are we gonna name this rat? What are we gonna call our rat? Everybody, what do we call our rat? He's the captured rat. He needs a better name than that. So we had bananas. <laughs> or no, Nanners. Nanners was our lemur. What are we going to call it's our new so pet rat? <laughs> Pester. Pester. Pester the rat. All right, that. go through that window. Gonna, Wait, which window? We're gonna put, so we're going to put the rat oh, in the soup. What? It's, like <laughs> it's not going to kill Listen, him, though. This is, this is not my choosing. This is the game. I will not be blamed for whatever happens to this rat. Do you I not? Refuse allow the game to excuse your moral decision making here I'm we are using pest in the soup we are agents in this reality look what i'm about <laughs> to do vichy soir vichy soir it is vichy soir oh no oh cold <laughs> soup oh oh guy brush thank you thank better. you for making me feel better and uh, now so, who wants to eat cold soup isn't cold soup just Cereal? Like cereal? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. Uh, All right. Uh, you can just go out the door. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're going to get yelled at, but it's a... Oh, never mind. Oh, who cares if he sees you? Uh, I guess. Okay, basically, we want to steal this guy's job. Oh, but so... we're not going to clean. I'm Guybrush is a pirate. Guybrush, Guybrush is too good for just cleaning. Not, we just want money, man. Oh. We're just, this is the side hustle. Guybrush is actually going to get a job <laughs> to get money? <laughs> this might be the first... I mean, no, we got hired to got... get shoot out of a cannon, technically. Oh, good call. That was a dangerous job, though. I mean, but somebody's got to do it. How's, How's the tonight? student? How did he know, or how did we supposed to know? How gauche. <laughs> <laughs> we only serve gourmet oh. How gosh. Mm, we only serve the vicious so well. Burn out. <laughs> oh no. Ah, it's a rat. <laughs> <laughs> this is Ratatouille. Okay, guys. Well, you're fired. <laughs> we just recreated Ratatouille. We really did. Oh, look, he looks so ashamed. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that guy was saving up to be a pirate. 
Oh. I want to know more about that guy. How cruel. We never learn about that guy. I hope he gets a better oh, job. He's like rubbing on his beard. I'd write him a better nice. recommendation. Can you cook? A little. Ah, fast paced world. Pub food cuisine. Let's see. Let's see. She got pay me. Uh, I don't know. How much does it pay? Ooh, that's good money. Hey. What? What kind of person pays in advance? That's crazy. You know what? He's trying to be upscale. He's trying to be ahead of the game. You know, maybe in fancier restaurants, they do pay you up front. So Guybrush is just going to take advantage. I mean, this. luckily, we already know how to escape. So we're not working. Oh, Jump man. Up. Well, sister, it's about that time. What? Aww. We got ourselves a job. We stole it from... <laughs> Wait, what happened to the rat? Quickly, check if it's still in the soup. Oh, pick up rat hairs. Oh, I must have ran away. Oh. I've never been much for rodent seasoning. Avec rat Ew. hairs. Oh, they're poor rat. Poor uh, pester. Oh. Okay, folks, this has been right. uh, season two. the premiere of season two, episode one. Brother, sister, play Monkey Island 2. Thanks for showing up, everybody, and we can't wait to play with you again next week. As always, yep. remember to like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Follow all the things. It's brother, sister. Brother, sister. We're just playing games.